Hello and welcome back to Website Tutor. First of all, I would like to thank all of you because we hit 1k plus subscribers. Today, I will teach you about progress bar and alert in Bootstrap. So first of all, open Visual Studio Code. Control N for new file. Control S and save it. Save that file in that folder which you created first. I created first YouTube as you know and in YouTube I created a subfolder which is named by bootstrap and here I am saving the file. progress bar dot html now html ratio 5 a short code for type all that structure in head tag here place I enter and paste all that short codes which we use for bootstrap to link that offline files after that in body tag open a div give a class If you don't know what is container, at the end of this video, you can see the link of that video in which I covered container, container fluid and many more. Now open a heading tag. basic progress bar after that heading tag open a new div give a class to this div progress bar after that commas space style give a height width Sorry, I put up is equal to and that semicolons will end here after that height of 10 pixels. Now close that div. Sorry I forgot that, after that heading tag, 
and above that div there is another div with a class of progress after that columns space style for styling this div and this div will close after that this div cut that and paste it after this now you can also check by clicking this you can see a hover this is the starting end of the div and this is the ending end open a tag to break a line and create another progress bar with some different style so that you can practice easily in this div open another div with a class of progress bar give a width to this one as we give also here in this we give 40% so in here I will give 60% also we have to give a height in the above progress bar we give 10 pixels so here we can increase to 20 pixels and now close the div here another break tag and after that open another div for alert In this div, open a tag of strong Now you can put a paragraph or one line I am just putting one line After that control S and save the file. It is automatically saved in that folder which I saved first. Go to that directory.
open YouTube folder, open bootstrap subfolder. Here you can see a progress bar file, HTML file and open it within a Chrome. Now you can see basic progress bar. that heading here we give a progress of 30 pixels and to the progress bar we give 20 pixels so in that there is a little bit difference you can see now I will change it control S for save and open that refresh it now you can see the bar cover total area of the progress here is the alert which we created strong that's it this is today's class i know this is short but this is very knowledgeable class if you like this video then subscribe this channel and click on bell icon for more videos also if you have any questions ping me on facebook page link in description and the one last thing show some support on patreon link in also in description